Assault, you with me? Always. Call of Duty is the most popular game out there. It's been around for so many years, has so many fans. My name is Jamie Gray Heider. I play Lieutenant Nora Salter. She's a badass fighter pilot, sort of a mix between a Top Gun pilot and a Navy SEAL. And she's also Lieutenant Reyes, who's the player character. She serves as his partner in the game. When you're working in video games, you don't have a set like you do in film and television. We use the space that you see behind me here, along with some Apple boxes, some tape, you know, a few things for you to touch and move around, but other than that, you're looking at it. They kind of give you a reference video when you first come in to shoot that day. They walk around the room and they show you what the game will look like, and you kind of commit that to memory so that when you're in here, you have the set in your mind while you're kind of walking around in a blank space. You also have no wardrobe. We're all wearing the same thing. So there's no way to differentiate using wardrobe. But physically, there's no camera. There's no point of focus. There's no point of reference because you have 80 cameras shooting you in the round, your performance has to be considerate of a 360 space because you never know what performance they're gonna pull from. So while there's no camera that you're performing for, there is one camera that is probably about four inches from your face the entire time and is doing nothing but capturing your facial expressions. You kind of have to get used to having this thing that just floats right in front of your face with its own light just shining right in your eyes the whole time. And after a few weeks, you actually start to forget about it until you open a cabinet into your face or... So if you're working on a typical episode of one hour television, you're looking at like a 60, 70 page script. If you're working on a film, you're looking at 120, 150 pages of material. For a video game, such as Call of Duty Infinite Warfare, we actually work through over 700 pages of dialogue. So you have no set, you have no camera, you have no wardrobe. Um, but you do have the people around you. If you were shooting a scene with another actor, that actor was there and that character was there so that we really got the sense of the relationships that we're building throughout the game. One major difference is I don't get to go sit in a theater and watch my work. I have to really earn that right in this situation and I will be playing on recruit level first, but I'm super excited to actually play through the game. But in this case, if you wanna watch what you spent 15 months doing, I actually have to fight my way through the game to get that far.